The year is 1928. Walt Disney invents Mickey Mouse and the first pioneers try to cross the oceans by plane. Who's going to watch what's happening in the tranquil town of Essen? But great things are also happening here. Up to this point, electrical installations were implemented with inflexible 10-pole ceramic blocks. In 1928, Hugo Knumann, the founder of Phoenix Contact, had the idea of arranging these blocks as individual modules on the Dean rail. This was the birth of the first modular terminal block. This is one of the first ceramic terminal blocks. Will this be a success story? Let's wait and see. Rock and roll! There's rebellion in the air and the ceramic terminal block is also facing a revolution. Phoenix Contact produces new terminal blocks made of a duoplast. These are not only significantly more resistant, but also more economical to produce. So, this is 1976 and the modular terminal block is about to celebrate its 50th birthday. Time to evolve again after ceramic and duoplast. This is the UK terminal block. As you can see, it is made of plastic now. This material conversion has paved the way for mass production. Three, two, one. We are on the verge of the millennium and Phoenix Contact ends the 20th century with a new connection technology. ST technology is the first terminal block with a spring connection. It enables particularly fast wiring and offers a double functional shaft. This is how the new millennium can start. Wow, that's what I call a really big milestone. In 2009, Phoenix Contact launches the push-in connection technology. From now on, you can connect conductors easily, quickly and without tools. I'll show you how it works. That's it. The orange pusher becomes the trademark for fast and effortless connectivity. With push-in, the first steps towards an automated wiring are done. PushX. This connection technology, launched in 2022, means connectivity of the next level. PushX enables direct wiring with rigid and flexible conductors with or without ferrules. Insert the conductor without force to the end of the clamping chamber. As soon as the conductor presses down the locking device, the slide is released and the contact spring snaps shut automatically. Thanks for joining us on our journey through the history of connection technologies. And if you want to learn more, visit our PushX landing page, phoenixcontact.com slash push minus X.